think this is the end? It might be the end. Hello, one and all. This is Luckless Love Lux. Welcome back to Life is Strange, episode five, final episode. Let's see what we can do. Let's focus on this photo and see if we can make things better. This is like, I feel like it's like the 70 millionth time that we tried this and it just never works out. I think Max is starting to come to the same realization as I am that she's, she's probably causing all this. Hey, be careful out there. Damn right I'm kissing him. For luck. Words the best. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say. I know, Lauren. Of course you do. I'm gonna make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. Pressure's on. Only the right choices. Have you been drinking? Dang, that's a great shot. We got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. <sighs> Chloe. Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. We can tell her what- Sorry, we were in We can tell her. Let's go, now. Chloe, wait, listen. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe. You can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit. Nathan is the fucking serial killer. We you saw believe the us? Now, excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Huh. Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? We can rewind time! Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Okay, um... Jefferson killed him. Jefferson is, is a psychopath. Jefferson hurt me. Let's go, Jefferson hurt me. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No. Not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and... I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? That's how I feel, too. What do you mean, Max? What did you do? <sighs> Terrible choice. That's Chloe, that's what we did. I'm I'm going to tell you the truth no matter what. Yes, that's a good idea. I changed your past and I I I had to make a terrible choice and I I Max Please tell me. I won't be mad at you. I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. 
You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And... You, you were in pain. You were slowly dying. And you... You asked me to... End your life. But Chloe... There was no way I could do that. I had to return to this timeline. To see you again. I had to. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I... I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. Yes. Right. That's why you should come with me so we can stay together and stay alive i hear you max but do you think we should let jefferson get away with torture and murder of course not if we tell david he'll believe us and he can actually stop him right i don't get it why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day he's not even at our house anymore because he's yeah he saved us cares about you david was ahead of us Chloe, save me. David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you. But I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Okay, okay. Good. Perfect. Storm. No storm. Shit. Of course. Can we ever stop this thing? Oh, Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive, oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked, it actually worked. You're with me again. It looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And you traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. What? Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. You don't want her out of our life. My powers have caused in just a short time. I'm nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure, but not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. 
you, you remember, right? Well, we, we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Just get the hell out of here. Why are you standing there? I can't there? even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Is this stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on. <sighs> Chloe, I've got your back, Rex. Whoa. What? Alfred Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. I'm what back in class. As he what the hell? What the hell is right? These pieces of time can frame us in our glory. I have our to sorrow. listen to this Jefferson Light lecture again. This From might be hell. Now. Can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the human up. condition in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Can we use our power? No. Bueller. Diane Arbus. Be calm. Oh, we can. Don't freak out. Go, Victoria. Why Yet. Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. I feel like totally haunted what the by hell? of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture, right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? <laughs> Keep that to yourself. What the fuck? Seriously though, I could frame We're losing it, aren't we? And capture you in a moment of desperation. Holy shit. Oh, Everybody what? There's blood there where now. Kate was. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Too creepy. It's a picture of us when we were captured. I'm sorry, Kate. Not yet, you bastard. Max, if you're reading this, it means you're dead. Mr. Jefferson. Holy shit. Look at all these dead birds. Uh, this can't be real. We're hallucinating or we're dreaming or. Or we're dead. Did we die? Stuck in some like purgatory. Oh, no. Rachel didn't deserve any of this. We're, we're like reliving our memories. I'm not going to take the bait. I'm not. Max Colefield, a loser. Does she hurt everybody she helps? Yes. Everyday zeros. Photo contest. I see you, Max Caulfield. The Don't hell? even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Where the hell did he come from? I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. What? No way. I love you, Mr. Jefferson. Our dark room, my selfies are shit. Thanks for killing Chloe. Uh, sh let's go with the least, least like creepy thing. My selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes, you will be posing for me. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. can't be real. I don't believe it. 
Okay. This is not, this is not going to be fun. Got Kate. Hey, Kate. Max. How could you let me jump off a roof? You were the only person I trusted here. But you never really listened to me. Now I'm never going to heaven. Instead, you've stuck me in hell. Alone forever. No! Kate, I, I was only trying to save you. Jesus! Oh god. We are in hell, aren't we? We're in our own personal hell. Which one should we go into? Maybe go into our own? Showers? No. I think we have to go into our own. I present the spare piece flush. Anything except brick. The hell? Oh, there's a key. Max, this is not the best time for a prank. Keys, please. Two eighteen. Key to 218. 219. 220. There's still a key here. Find it. Oh, there we go. We're in, we're in Rachel's clothing now, aren't we? Rachel, she was my angel. After my dad died, we moved. Rachel Amber, 224. Rachel saved my life. So Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. You suck, Victoria. Oh, look, it's nice to talk to The selfie hair is black. So, we're all the different characters? Shh, I think she can hear us. Which one was it? Was it 220 or? I think it was the other, I think it was the previous one. I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. 221. I think my entry for the contest might be too good. This is, this is creepy. All the selfies. Give me a max selfie. Whoa. Oh, what's that? What the hell? This one is for Samuel. Oh, man. Oh, 
It's like the Red Room in Twin Peaks. Coming back to the beginning. The hell? Well, sketch over in the pet cast scars. Well, pass it well, sketch over then a day. What the hell? I like how it says cool. Because cool is, is, you know, look backwards. Cool, red sop. club, they'd never pull that. Oh, well, he's never changed. That's cool. Of course, everything's playing backwards, so it's the right direction. I had no idea. Of course, the bathroom, right? That was fucking cool. Oh, God. Don't try to hide, Max. Get over here. Let me capture you. Jefferson is coming after me again. Max! No. You used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. Please understand, Max. But I gotta get captured. The only place I... Oh, Max! What? How many of them are there? The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. I can't oh, shoot. believe you let that hillbilly murder me in cold blood. What happened to your spark, Max? I thought I could be your professor. Okay, let's get get by here. Life. Oh. oh, don't come this way. I realize now okay. you'll never be an artist, much less a photographer. Come here, Max. There's another one. There's another one. Okay. Class is dismissed. I miss those days when you looked at me in class with those wide okay. eyes. Okay, he's not coming this way. I want to be your professor again. Go by him. Teach you so much. Got to avoid the light here. I bet. Good evening, Blackwell. This is Principal Wells, and I'm here to. Drop the mic on Max Caulfield. Max. Oh, shoot. Drop the mic on Max Caulfield. 
Okay. Attention. I regret to announce. We're sneaking? Who's that? Is that Warren? Or it's Max, David, probably. Where are you? Nope. Max, come out to play. Max! To play. Come out to play. Why are you afraid of uh, Warren, though? Hey, babe, babe. Who wants to go, Abe? Go ape, go ape, just babe, Price babe. can't just show up at Blackwell in a wheelchair and think we're going to accommodate her every whim. And cheat your friends out of life. Holy shit, you really think Victoria's going to be your best friend forever? Ha! She will always hate you. Okay, okay, gotta go back. Samuel wants to make sure you never snoop around his room. Snitches get stitches. God, there's so many of them now. Hey, Max. Please, Only come here. A feminazi. So I can beat you up. Jesus. Bony ass over here. I'm gonna cut you open, freak. They're all looking for us. Those were my bees, Max. Bottles. Rachel. Oh, no. Bottles. Just like her hey, Max. This might be hell. Just like her last name, I can finally see right through her skin and feel that she's posing for me in hell. Well, these ones aren't too hard to find. The hell? What? Just what is going on? What are we doing? Max, sit down. You're taking a time out no matter what. This is my nightmare. Let me have one sanctuary. Of course, this is where Chloe and Rachel used to hide from the world but I can't hide for long whatever reality I'm in feels like a bad dream how do we get ourselves out of this am I just not learning my lesson maybe your real lesson is to get out of this place I certainly don't want to stay here just don't be afraid Max let them be afraid of you Did you get high like Rachel? What? Oh, that must be someone else saying that. I deserve to die, Max. Oh, oh when did I get bad bottle karma? Me and Rachel are floating down. Just these bottles. I remember we collected them before, right? But looks like there are still bottles to find. Oh, joy. Oh, I have to go back and find the bottles. Booty smack talk you. It was brutal. But of course, I see what she's talking about now. Oh yeah, I see. I see one right there. It's gonna be so. Is there one more left? You took some of my your carcass next to Maybe Rachel you into an epic photo shoot. One left, looks like. Max, Rachel knows. There it is. Great headshots. She gave great hits. What the? Oh, Max! Please let that be the last one. What the fuck? Especially after. Doing? Max. No, nope, back. She gave great. Hey, Max. What the fuck ever you gonna do now that I'm dead? So confused. Okay, we got all of them. Max, you need to get high like Rachel. I need proof that bottles were out to get me, just in case. <laughs> what? <laughs> No, let's come back. Made in Taiwan. Oh, we're in the snow globe. Snow globe of, uh... What the hell is going on here? Don't you 
dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am. When your mom is away, I'll let her know that. Oh, we're actually on the fireplace. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two win. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Safe Mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us you to waste You are ridiculous. Upon. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Oh, God, we're looking at ourselves. With the keys. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Aha. You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. What? Hey Max, would you say hi to Chloe and Joyce? Don't forget to remind them that you let me die. What the f what? Max, this is your old pal Chloe. You left in a wheelchair in another reality. Did I thank you before you bailed to a new life? Not only did you blow off my request, you already jumped into another photo. How many fucking times can you abandon me, Kippy? All oh, this is all the horrible stuff we've done to them, right? Max, I loved your photo shoot with Jefferson. He absolutely captured you. If you want, we can hang out and get high. No thanks. Pompadou. Bitch, do not mess with Frank or me. You got a snack. <laughs> what? Rachel. Hi, Max. Rachel Amber here. Just wanted to introduce myself. I'll be seeing you soon. Real soon. So we're dead. Samuel. Good evening, young Max. The squirrels talk to me. But how can you? Samuel has no phone. How long will this nightmare go on? Okay, I can, I can rewind now. I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? I'm so over her hipster bullshit. I think everyone at Blackwell is over Max. Let's prove it. Holy shit, Warren. Max is trying to play us both. I guess she's not as innocent as she acts. Not when she's trying to hook up with both of us. I only want to go ape with you, Chloe. Come here. They're just taking all of our decisions and they're just throwing it back at us. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I hear that. Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. <laughs> oh shit, look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Not a little girl like Max. I fucking love your tots, Chloe. You're so hot. I can't believe Why is my it controller took us shaking? so long to hook up. Why is my controller shaking? Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Rachel's dead and you're still alive. Life is so not fair. I wish she would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. Keypad. Oh. 
I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. What? I mean, what? Do we have a code? I. Oh, did I, did I write something down? What? What code am I supposed to put in here? Great. Numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code? Oh, the controller's shaking a bit. Maybe when I look at the right code? It's like right. I don't know. I have no idea. Oh, in the mirror. So confused. Thought maybe the mirror would show me. I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Should I just start putting in codes? Why doesn't the mirror reflect any of the numbers? Right. Thought that was just like, oh, there we go. One, one, three, zero. No. Zero three one one. There we go. Don't kill us, Max. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Great. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. Shit, Max. I thought we were on the same team. Now I'll die alone. Max, I hope you do I the right thing. You kissed me. I hope. Now you're going to kill me? Max, please save us. Save the Bigfoots, Max. Please. The Big Feet. Honey, I always thought of you like a daughter. And now you're going to take me away from my family. Why would you do that? Max. You're exactly the kind of soldier I'd want by my side in a war. Son of a bitch, this is gonna hurt. So this is how Max gets her revenge on. Like I told you before, old fishermen never die. Well, Honey, I break her, break her. me is so Thanks for saving me. Oh, cool. I know I have a husband the husband best Oh, husband God. We'll have to go well, down to the beach where I've been friends, Max. Hero for us. But please, oh. don't let me die like this. I'm still a teenager. You've always please, had my Max, back, don't and now me, you're so going to let me die. We can finally have our tea set. Who, who are you? Holy shit, are you cereal? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers? Uh, we tried to, we tried to help. I tried to help. I only wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. 
Is that what we wanted? And once you got these amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you'd give a rat's ass. That's not true. That's not true at all. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? <laughs> you were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends. And I've used my powers for good. Please, stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? Yes. We all are. This isn't about Chloe. Or even me anymore. Gosh, you're so selfless now, Mahatma Max. It's too bad you pissed your power away on high school drama. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework, so you'll have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she has any feelings for us? You're just another puppet. Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh hell, speak of the devil. Chloe's here. Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. Chloe did some really yes, nice things for us. At school. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Wait, did I miss something Now over that here? we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? Or a storm is coming? Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic! I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This is supposed to demonstrate that Chloe is manipulating us. Time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super-sized? I don't feel so super. Uh, Max, here, um, let me help you find a place to chill. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? Do 
You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Welcome to my domain. You are magic! I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. Max, you better come check out these files. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. Why look, an odd- Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Hide! Hide! You Wait. can't go back to your dorm now, you're a Blackwell fugitive. I think I messed up. Tonight. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my- Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Hide! Hide! You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. Photo bomb. Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. Huh. You left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Definitely feels like a different world. Out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? I know. Just daydreaming. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Dude, I am so lucky that my father is cool. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> it's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. The worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. Wow, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. Oh god. We should have taken over Arcadia Babe when we had the chance. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and... Uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? 
What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. I'm not quite getting what this is supposed to be. Kate wasn't the first. It's just a recap. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel, this can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Th then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. Rachel! Path that we've I taken. Loved her so much. How can she be dead? What kind of world does this? Who does this? It all just leads to here every time. Come on, Max. We're almost there. Oh, and then this is the present? Please, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Max, come on now! I don't know if I can take this. Oh, God. This is going to be so sad, isn't it? Max! Max, can you hear me? Please say something. Chloe? I... I must have passed out. Oh, thank Sorry. God. Don't you ever do that again, okay? I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. This is my storm. I caused this. I caused all of this. I changed fate and destiny so much that I actually did alter the course of everything. And all I really created was just death and destruction. Fuck all that, okay? You were given a power. You didn't ask for it. And you saved me, which had to happen. All of this did, except for what happened to Rachel. But without your power, we wouldn't have found her. Okay, so you're not the goddamn Time Master, but you're Maxine Caulfield. And you're amazing. Max. This is the only way. What? I, I feel like I took the shot a thousand years ago. You, you could use that photo to change everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to, to, fuck that. No, no way. You are my number one priority now. You are all that matters to me. Oh God. I know you proved that over and over again. Even though I don't deserve it. I'm so selfish. Not like my mom. Look what she had to give up and live through. And she did. 
She deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my... my stepfather deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. No. Say that. What? I won't trade you. You're not trading me. Maybe you've just been delaying my real destiny. Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died around you. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. I know I've been selfish, but for once, I think I should accept my fate. Our fate, Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week, and you did nothing but show me your love and friendship. You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. Wherever I end up after this, and they're giving us the reality, same decision. All those moments between us were real, and they'll always be ours. No matter what you choose, I know you'll make the right decision. Chloe, I can't make this choice. No, Max. You're the only one who can. Oh my god. Oh. This is like this is the, the she's basically asking us to kill her again. Oh. All of Arcadia Bay against Chloe. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck it. We're being consistent. Oh, I can't believe I Max, just did that. It's time. I can't believe I just chose that. Not Give him the middle finger to destiny. Oh God. Now I get it. I get that whole path. It's like we've had so much, we've done so much with Chloe. Can we sacrifice her? Like it's like it's like impossible. Oh man! It's like how much would you be willing to sacrifice for the person that you love above like everything else? Would you be willing to sacrifice an entire city?
could Chloe and Max live with that too? I don't know. Oh God. All the dead people. That's it. That's the end. Wow. I don't I have no idea if I made the right choices at all throughout that game. I'm going to be quiet during the credits and I'll talk to you on the flip side and give you some final thoughts. They, oh, the song's backwards when they was playing backwards. Because because since time was moving backwards, that's that's funny. Clever, clever game. I'm gonna I'm gonna skip from here because there's a lot of uh, business people that are more involved here. But I'm gonna I'm gonna skip this. We're gonna get right to the decisions. Wow, look at that! It's almost fifty fifty. We are actually in the minority. We decided to sacrifice Arcadia Bay over Chloe. I'm really yeah. Polarized is a great name for this episode because. It's just, how are you supposed to make that choice? How are you supposed to make that choice? I'm really not good at making choices that are like, are that hard. Like there's so many, there's so much at stake. Regardless of what you choose. I, I think you could probably see that throughout my playthrough. It's like, it's just too good or bad, like bad choices, whatever way you look at it. I feel like this is the story of Max and Chloe. They should end it together. She sacrificed, Max sacrificed so much to save her. To just throw it all away at the end would make me feel as, like, would make me feel even more empty than sacrificing the entire town. But at the same time, it's like all those lives versus one life. I don't know. Let me know what you guys 
what you guys chose and what you thought of that decision. Um, let's take a look at the next other choices. Uh, David got a scar during the fight. Okay. Interesting. David killed uh, Jefferson. 45% minority there. You saved the trucker. Okay. You saved Evan. A lot of people didn't. Oh, no, no. Most people did get it. Saved Alyssa. I didn't save the fisherman. What? Wasn't he the one that was in the corner? I thought I, I thought I did. Okay. You helped Joyce believe in David again. Interesting. Most people didn't do that. I I think I think deep down David ha his heart's in the right place. It's just the way that he goes about the way that he acts and the way he goes about getting there is like all wrong. But I think Joyce can at least take him in the right direction, right? If he's just got nobody, he's going to just turn into a complete disaster. He told the truth about Rachel to Frank. Kissed Warren. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Most people pick that. All right. That's it. That's the end. That's the end of Life is Strange. I thought it was a great game. I don't need to tell you guys that. You you all know that. Um Let's let's exit to the main menu. I think um I think it's just like the just the way the game looks match matches so well with the theme of the game. It's all about art and the the world looks like kind of like a painting. She uses photographs to travel back in time to photographer. Um the choices, although they might not have like changed the storyline so much, they, they, they show you more about the characters, depending on what you pick. And um, they feel really, really impactful. And they're really hard to make, which is which is exactly what a game like this should be like. Um, and the voice acting was the voice acting was really good for the main characters. There was some Average to average to below average voice acting for some of the big characters, but top notch from the from the main cast. And uh, it's just a blast to play. I love this mechanic of rewinding time, and how they added this other aspect of it where Max would have nosebleeds, so it made you like think twice about doing it constantly. Which I was always like, I don't want to do it for this small little thing. I'd rather like I'd rather just deal with the consequences then possibly hurt Max more. Um, and I, I guess, you know, ultimately, like, at the end, that's what... Max is what caused the storm, or trying to mess with destiny or fate. But fuck that shit, right? We make our own destiny. And the um, Jefferson angle, I didn't see that coming. I just, like, I had so many suspects, it was hard to kind of predict which one they would go with. Could have been Samuel, it could have been Jefferson, could have been Princi Principal Wells for all we know, right? Um, I don't know, maybe I missed some like subtle clues. But uh, it was hard for me to predict who the killer was. Nathan, of course. David. They're all like, there's, there's a lot of really strong red herrings. Um, it's going to be really interesting to see what they do with the prequel. I'm concerned about the prequel because it's done by, it's made by a different team. The voice actress for Chloe um, isn't going to be back for it because of the uh, game voice actor strike. I'm, I'm concerned about it, but I'm going to play it anyways. So uh, thank you guys so much for joining me for this journey. I hope you enjoyed it. I know you've probably seen this game played a million times and you probably can't stop watching it because it's just so engaging and so emotional. And uh, it's just so great to see someone go through the adventure over and over again for the first time. And I hope you guys join me in the prequel, which I will start. It's probably going to be released, if not the day of this video, then the day after. I'm going to try to record it right away. Um, if you did enjoy this Let's Play, you can uh, subscribe to me, of course, youtube.com slash Andrew Erdeg. Um, you can uh, check me out on Twitter at Andrew Erdeg. That's E-R-D-E-G. You can find out when I post videos and when I go live on twitch.tv slash If you've got a few bucks, 
Um, you can go to uh, patreon.com slash lucklesslovelocks and pledge them to me. Helps me to get the newest games, new equipment to improve the quality of my recordings and my stream. And this is something I would love to do for a living. It would help me get a step closer to that dream. Every little bit matters. Wow. I don't know what else to say. Thank you guys for uh, commenting and watching and enjoying this amazing game with me. And I hope you'll go on uh, the next adventure with me, the prequel for the storm and a possible sequel as well. Life is Strange 2. I think they're working on that. This is Luckless Lovelocks signing off for good on Life is Strange. And I love you all.